The thrill and excitement of March Mania is here in DraftKings Sportsbook, one of the official top-rated sportsbook apps, is giving new customers a shot to turn five bucks into hundred and fifty dollars instantly in bonus bets with any college basketball bet. You can bet on the whole tournament, bet on your home team, especially if you live in North Carolina. Online sports betting is available to you now, so that means DraftKings is available to you now. So if you live in North Carolina, why don't you bet on your North Carolina? the Tar Heels. Uh, download the DraftKings Sportsbook app and use code VOCH, V-O-C-H, VOCH. New customers can bet five bucks and get $150 instantly in bonus bets only if you use DraftKings Sportsbook with code VOCH, V-O-C-H, VOCH. The crown is yours. And we back. Let's get into it. Jackson Powers Johnson. The first thing that kind of pops out to me on him is that he he just loves violence for no reason. He like he's the one character that's looking for all the smoke and he can't wait to engage in such smoke. And he's another one of these players that qualify as a, he may not win pretty, but he wins ugly. And if you a coach, it's just your job to teach him how to win pretty. He 100% qualify, qualifies for that because a lot of the ways that Jackson Powers Johnson wins, it's unconventional, but it works. He throws his body into people, but people fly when he throws his body into people. I'll still identify him before the duration of this video. He's the center. Here's an example. Boom. And he's just being the help guy right here because he's really, bam, bam, he's really, uh, him and this uh, left guard here, they're comboing this uh, head up two uh, to number 52 right here, right? Like that's the combo here. So as Jackson Powers Johnson is being the combo guy, it's his job to deliver a blow or just, uh, you know, give his left side here. He's choosing to use his left side to deliver a blow. Boom, 89 is out of there, but it's still his responsibility to block 52. But I love the awareness from Jackson Powers Johnson because 52 is not just sitting put. 52 is getting downhill. So Jackson Powers Johnson, instead of just sitting on his hands here, dealing with this with this, uh, with this this help situation, he's going to come off of it and bam, come over there and smash 52. And if, if, if Bucky Irvin was just a little more, all right. <laughs> but Jackson Powers Johnson did a fantastic job right here. Hey, more violence and more movement. The one thing I love about centers is if they're powerful. I think a lot of teams just take their worst offensive lineman or they take their 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 least powerful guy and they just kind of throw him at center because you can hide center amongst guards and just combo him, you know, just uh, combo into oblivion here. But what I like about Jackson Powers Johnson is that even if he has to hold his own in 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 certain situations here, hey, number twenty literally could have just found a gap and just hey, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna follow fifty eight. If he will have he would have followed fifty eight then the offensive lineman, pardon me, the D lineman that uh, that Jackson Powers Johnson engaged here was not in the same A gap that he left him. So that's always a win for me. More violence. Just another example of, of more violence here. We have a simple counter concept. Your front side is going to down block. Jackson Powers Johnson is going to get down on that too. And then you're going to see your pullers from your backside here. But right now we're just focused on Jackson Powers Johnson's block, which is this down block here. We're basically creating a wall because these pullers here on the right side are going to the opposite side. So Jackson Powers Johnson, it's his job to create this wall. And boy, does he keep this down lineman on the other side of the Jackson Powers Johnson wall. Not only does he does he get him on the opposite side of that wall, but you see Jackson Powers Johnson finishing the character here. And then he's just going to lay on top of it, man. That's that's how you do it, man. Don't just throw him down on the ground. That's being a bad sport. Fall on top of him to really know that you're all in on the game. You're giving your 100%. And just for giggles, here's another example of Jackson Powers Johnson throwing his body into another character and then proceeding to go block the linebacker. He does this pretty consistently, so I think I can say it as a trait of his. He violently throws his body into these combos, but he still has the awareness and he keeps his eyes up to get to the second level and block linebacker. I think that's pretty impressive. And I just encourage y'all to go watch my senior bowl film because when you watch him in pass pro Jackson Powers Johnson really has a great anchor. Uh, you know, he, he only goes backwards as much as he needs to, but besides that, he's not gaining unnecessary depth or unnecessary ground going backwards. Once again, we don't want to be in the laps of the quarterback here. And by the time he engages and sits down on this D lineman here, Bo Nix has a, has a, has a pretty comfortable pocket to throw in. Bo Nix doesn't even have to move right here. So, uh, that's, that's one of the big things about Jackson. Powers Johnson's that he may go backwards a little bit, but once he sets his feet, he no longer does that. Appreciate y'all for tuning in, man. Y'all do all the liking algorithm things, man. I love y'all to pieces. Till next time. Salute.